Today I wanted to review a new and currently airing Chinese drama called Crossfire. Crossfire stars Lu Han and Liu Wu who plays Zhao Feng and Lu Zhao Bei respectively. Here is a synopsis from My Drama List. Despite living in different years, Lu Zhao Bei and Zhao Feng transcend space and time as they chance upon each other within the same game. From a position of mutual distrust to that of camaraderie, they form their own teams, map out their tactics to help each other grow. In the year 2008, Xiao Feng is a downcast esports captain who is barely keeping his team together. In the year 2019, Lu Xiao Bei is a young man in a wheelchair. He vowed to continue his brother's legacy to become a professional esports player, yet loses his chance to join a professional team because of an accident. Unlike many esports dramas that focuses on League of Legends or Dota type games which is also known to be multiplayer online battle arena games. Crossfire is an online tactical first-person shooter game. As someone who played Crossfire in the past I find it nostalgic and a very interesting concept. Since the release of this drama, Lu Han has been a hot discussion topic among netizens. Many have criticized Lu Han's appearance in the drama and calling it ugly as it was a change from his normal image. Lu Han did respond to these criticisms and said that his appearances in the drama is an accurate portrayal of how esports players looked at the time. In my opinion though, even if Lu Han was wearing a potato sack he's still handsome no matter what lol. So far I have watched 10 episodes of the drama and I can say that it's very addicting both Lu Han's and Leo Wu's portrayals of their characters is done extremely well. I also appreciate the integration of the game in the drama it brings in the characters from the drama into the video game world and uses various perspectives which makes it feel like you're immersed in the game. The CGI is done so well and it's super accurate to how the game is like. Unlike other esports dramas like Go Go Squid or Gang Your Heart where the main plot is romance and love, Crossfire focuses on the friendship, brotherhood and the gaming aspects of the plot and has romance as a subplot instead. I enjoyed this approach a lot maybe because it's something we don't often see in dramas. And in my opinion this drama is better than all the other esports dramas so far. The script of this drama is very well written and targets a large audience so you don't have to be a fan of games to enjoy this drama. I can easily see this drama being one of the most popular dramas of 2020 even if you're not a big esports fan and don't play games at all this drama is still really worth checking out and I highly recommend it. Anyways thanks for watching this video and let me know if you want me to do more drama reviews or recommendations.